Hey friends, welcome to day 28 of Quarantunes. Can you believe it? 28 fucking days of Quarantunes. That's four goddamn weeks. And man, we are starting to run thin, I think, for interest. Interest has peaked like the first week. But you know what? I'm still here. I'm still rocking these out every goddamn day like fucking hotcakes. Every goddamn day serving this shit up like McDonald's. So you know what? Fuck all of you people that don't want to watch, and I love all of you people that do want to watch. Y'all are my favorites. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. Mwah. But, um, yeah. Today, we've got a special one for you. We are going to get in our fucking DeLoreans. We are going back in time to the awesome motherfucking 80s. So, tease your hair up to the fucking heavens. Pop your goddamn collars because it's gonna get fucking lit, fam, okay? <laughs> yeah. Wear your day glow shit. Uh, I don't know. You know, whatever else happened in the 80s. We're gonna walk like an Egyptian. Um, moon walk, if you're still cool with Michael Jackson. You know, uh, you know, whatever. We're gonna do all... No, actually, we're not gonna do any of that stuff. I'm just going to wear it. I wore this polo shirt specifically so I could pop this fucking collar because honestly, it's like either this or like the mid 2000s where all the douchebags are doing this. I know the douchebags are doing it in the 80s too. So like it kind of checks out, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, it's 80s day at Periwinkle 39. Uh, kind of sort of maybe kind of requested an 80s songs because she's writing this like three minute a baby kind of thing so she didn't specifically request this song but you know i decided i like this song let's do the song so we have everybody wants to rule the world by tears for fears today i love this song i love tears for fears well i say that i not don't really know a lot of their stuff i've never really delved deeply into their catalog before just know kind of the hits, you know? Shout. That's, honestly, that's like the worst one of their hits, in my opinion. Obviously, Everybody Wants to Rule the World. Great fucking song. Love that shit. Uh, Head Over Heels. That's a good fucking one. That might be my favorite Tears for Fears, actually. Used to Perfection and Donnie Darko. So, I dig that. Um... And then, you know, that brings up fucking Mad World, right? That's a classic that people seem to really like. Uh, I don't... I don't know. I I guess I don't know any other Tears for Fears songs. Oh, well! It's Tears for Fears. It's the 80s today. Collars popped. We're good. Um, This song, 1985. The year of my sister's birth. How cute is that? Uh, from the album Songs from the Big Chair, I believe. If I know my Tears for Fears discography, which I don't really, but I'm pretty sure that's right. Because it's such a weird name. <laughs> so, I honestly don't really have a lot to say about this. Uh, we ran pretty long yesterday with my tribute to Jerry Stiller. And then my big stories about Elton John. Uh, so let's keep this one short today and just pretty much get right to it, I think, because I don't really have anything to talk about, Tears for Fears-wise. Yeah, I don't, uh, I got nothing, honestly. I guess we could talk about the 80s, uh, you know, Reaganomics, I guess. That shit doesn't fucking work, does it? Clearly. Uh, I'm an 80s baby myself, barely, just barely made the cut in the middle of 1989 there, so I was around when the Berlin Wall was still standing, so yeah, 80s babies for life, woo, just barely, I was not even barely conscious there, you know, July of 89, like, I barely made the cut, but I made the cut, hey, raise a glass to that one, huh? But uh, 80s is pretty cool, I guess. Um, 90s is pretty cool, too. I, all the decades are pretty cool, really. I don't have anything against anybody else's decade of birth, honestly. So, you know, whatever. Anyway, I guess we should probably just get to the fucking song. Because, again, I don't have anything to talk about. And, uh... 
Yeah. So, everybody grab your uke and let's play a little Tears for Fears. Uh, classic 80s hit here. Play along with me, why don't you? Um, you're not going to. I know you won't. I'm not giving you chords or anything. You don't know what the fuck you're doing. I barely know what the fuck I'm doing, so. I've only practiced this like once, so let's just see how the fuck we do it here, shall we? <sighs> here we go. to rule the world tears for fears uh it was a serviceable uh cover i think <laughs> not my best but not my worst either i guess i probably should have faded out with the uh but like that's just kind of weird and i should have stuck it in the middle too you know but it's just kind of weird so i only did it once sorry not sorry um yeah hope you enjoyed the trip to the awesome 80s we made today and i hope to see you tomorrow again for something completely different and i have no idea what it will be and fuck all who fucking knows it's really just depending on my mood i was gonna do a sad song earlier because i was like it's like fucking rainy as shit out there I was not feeling it, but you know, I perked up and I decided to go for the 80s. So we'll see what tomorrow brings. Maybe I'll perk up and decide to do something cool too. <laughs> or maybe I'll perk down and decide to not do something cool. Well, I'm gonna do something cool regardless, irregardless to use a uh, 
not a word. Uh, I'm going to do something cool. I always do something cool. If you don't think what I do is cool, then you know what? That makes me sad. Because these songs are all cool. I think. Except for Riptide. But we don't even we don't even talk about that one, do we? So anyway, thank you all for tuning in today. Stay cool. Keep the fire. I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Love you guys. <laughs> Bye.